I've had questions regarding the MLS or the multiple listing service. Today I'd like to answer some of those questions, so stay tuned. Hi, I'm Kelly Nitz of the Kelly Nitz team. Thanks for joining me today. Let me try to answer some of the questions I've received recently regarding the MLS, otherwise known as the multiple listing service. Number one, what is the multiple listing service? I get this question asked a lot, and what it is, is the multiple listing service is also known as the MLS, and it is a cooperation amongst many real estate companies that belong to a board of realtors, and in our area, it's the Toledo Board of Realtors or the Wood County Board of Realtors, which we are called the Toledo Regional Association of Realtors. Um, and realtors pay a fee to belong, and all of the real estate companies share information about all of their listings. It's called broker reciprocity, so that we can all get access and maximum exposure for our listings. Mm -hmm. Collectively, we all represent a large inventory of homes to show to our buyers. So for my buyer clients, this means I can show them houses that are listed with Remax, Danbury, DeSalle, Wells Bowen, Lost Realty, or any other company belonging to our multiple listing service. Question number two from a buyer. If I want to see a house that has a Danbury sign in the front of it, you can show it even though you're a Remax agent? And the answer to that is yes. At the Toledo Board of Realtors, there are over 1,400 members, and a realtor can show a listing that is listed with any company within the Board of Realtors. So if you're a buyer, and you should, you should really pick one agent to work with and let that agent show you houses rather than calling a different agent for each house listed. It's a lot easier to deal with one real estate professional. And if that agent is giving you good service, you should stick with that agent. Number three, who pays the real estate agent? The listing agent offers the selling agent a portion of the listing commission. About 80% of all sales closed are cooperating agents from different companies working to get the deal together. And agents are only paid if they make a sale. They are commission salespeople. And so they are willing to work harder for you if you are very loyal to them also. And finally, number four, what is broker reciprocity? Broker reciprocity is when a real estate brokerage signs documents giving other companies permission to advertise our listings on their website or on the internet. So if you go to a company's website, um, it will state if the home you are viewing is through broker reciprocity or not. The multiple listing service has been a great innovation for both home buyers and home sellers. It increases the number of prospects for your home if you're selling and gives the buyer a greater inventory of homes to choose from if they're buying. I'd like to thank you for allowing me to share this information with you today. If you found it helpful and you liked it, click the like button. And if you want to receive more videos as they become available, um, just subscribe below and we'll notify you as soon as the next video is available for viewing. And if you have any comments or questions, um, we'd love to hear what our viewers are having to say about our topic. So if you have any, anything to add to the topic, leave it in the comment section below or any questions, put it in the comment section and we'll answer any questions as soon as we're available to do that. Um, thanks again for joining us today.